and then you just get these clothes on, and then I'll start chopping. All right. So I'm gonna do something a bit different today. I wanted to do big plant, the biggest I've ever done. Though it will be half the size, it'll be on this side, and it'll be in four seasons, segmented with my green tape. Uh, um, I know, no, blue painter's tape. Painter's tape I got, it's two types. Uh, blue painter's tape, and I'll tell you why I don't use it. I'll just skip a bit until I actually start playing if this don't interest you. But, I mean, you can see right here, much bigger than the green one. It takes too much space. This is for in more industrial use of paint, which this isn't really industrial now, is it? Now, this is smaller. I got this recently. Now, what I didn't know is, y'all can't see it, but can't really demonstrate it here because I've got these gloves on. But when you try to peel it, it don't want to leave the roll. Unlike these where it seamlessly, you know, I can do it here, takes off right here. This, it don't want to do that. So, um, if y'all, if you look closely, or if, if you can see, I'm just doing it just because over here, maybe you'll see the white multiple times. It has just stayed in this roll and not given away. So I could never peel it off. I would use it if I could, but it just does not want to be used. So I just don't use it. Uh, so anyway, I got over here, my colors segmented in how I'm going to use them. Uh, over here is going to be summer. Here's spring. Over here would be winter. This is fall. So, yeah, I, I didn't want to put, have it segmented like this because I didn't want to have summer right next to fall because the colors are pretty similar. Uh, even if you see, see like the orange here, it will be a bit similar. You see over here that they're both reds. I could, I wanted to use them on the yellow, but I really wanted to differentiate it, make it more of a difference than just, you know, a, a yellow and a slightly darker yellow. So, but the spring and winter, they're their own. But even if they do look similar, which with the, this color palette, they won't, hopefully. Um, if they're opposite sides, it'll be, um, less bad if they're right next to each other okay i'm also going to use a bag this time alongside uh, the newspaper hopefully it will help have a lighter texture and use it much more lightly for the winter and some of the others as well um to have more of a frosted look so yeah you'll you see what i plan to do with this hopefully it does go well i'm gonna stop Jabbing on. And as you start painting, I'm gonna move this over here. So the line. I have weights over here to put on. Yeah, over here would be my template that I cut out from a trash can of, if you guess. Yeah, I'm gonna have that on in orange. I'm going to have to go over with orange a little bit more. Brown. What you're going to take. I'll, I'll use some yellow. Because this really does need some brightness in it. So, put this back. Add some more. I didn't make brown, but right over here. Okay, that's good. Okay. Maybe if just a little bit too much paint. Um, sprinkle this up. <clears throat> I'm gonna let this dry a little bit. Is that Johnson? Video recording right now, Dan. Pick up ground. Okay. So I'm gonna wait for this to dry a little bit. And have this this off-white instead of normal white so there's more in theme yeah and uh, over here now y'all probably won't see a difference but there is a difference this is uh, not over here this is much brighter 
than the off white. Even if y'all don't see the media, it, it will show itself. I'm gonna have a little bit dark pink, but I'm gonna have brown over here. There we go. Let that sit for a few seconds. Not get the bag yet. Get this. Put it down. And then very lightly tap on. And then okay. exhale. There we go. Okay. Now I'm just going to dab here and here. Okay. Yeah, I like that. And that came out beautiful. Really proud of that. Um, let's take this out. Place this over here. Have paint I'm not using. Put it like right there. There we go. There we go. And this will just stay over here. It will protect this part. Um, should I put paint in now? Um, no, I'll do it all together later on. So I'm gonna put this on. Actually, I'm gonna do the paint. I'm gonna do the shading now. Now this is ready to place down. There we go. Okay. Now this is when I'm gonna use the plastic bag, and I'm not gonna use off white. Use normal white. This is winter. Okay. I'm gonna have this on the bottom. I'm gonna try to. Spray this as lightly as I can, but it is not really coming off as light. It has a two time coverage, as y'all can see on the label, so it does disperse quite quickly. Okay, and that's good. And light blue is going to be more off white. But I'm going to use actual white later on. So for winter, I'm going to have more white than I do black for shading. And over here, add black. Okay. Even after that, I'm still going to put white over it. Wait for it to dry a little bit. I do want it to come off very, um, uh, what's the word? Very thinly. I, I don't want a lot to come off. I want it to be crisp. And it's probably not what, that's probably not what's gonna happen. I mean, you can't just redo it because it's just gonna get even more wet and dense. So it's now or never. I kinda have to just fan this down. And don't scratch myself with this. Okay, so let me just scratch back here. Cut it down so it's a better uh, piece of equipment. Okay. I'm move some of this stuff. Bear with me here. Okay. I'm going to place this down very lightly. Cut down. And then we're going to move. Okay. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna see what happens if I do it more heavily this time. Pat it down this time. And then remove. Unfortunately, um, y'all can already see some 
the fall colors came in. And that's not that is not good at all. That's nasty. So I'm gonna get. But I need some of this. Press down. Still, spray again. Again, um, more heavier colors this time. Really, this is why I didn't want to do this. So now, I'll it all over again. That ain't gonna be good. to work with tags because it's texture I really don't like or it can be worked with well but sometimes it goes out pretty fine like that and again there's still colors over here which I don't like um, I guess I'm just gonna have to deal with that. Now the colors over here are gonna that. I mean, this is fine, because I'm not gonna be able to notice, um, let alone someone else, because they're so similar in a way. This, it, it's more sheer contrast. Um, what should I do, what to do, what to do? And somehow, the orange still crept up. Y'all can't see it, but I can still see it here. Like here. Yeah, it's there. It's, it's not just some leaf. I don't want to, did not want to do this. I did not want it. I'm going to flick, fix it. I'm going to put a mist over. dark Season we're in right now. Let's get to it. Um, I'm actually gonna bring out some dark greens for this one. I wanted to use navy blue for winter, um, but kind of ran out of time. Because now it's over here. And I can't. I, I, don't tell you. I don't want to mess it up. At this Rising up. Some spring green. Right here. And yes, that's its name. Coincidental. Of um, green apple. I always liked how they named these things in marketing. It peels, but I just like the color. The name doesn't really do much for me. And last but not least, we're going to have a new peak. 
another off-white color. I don't know why this spot in particular, probably because it's too dense, is resisting this pink. No, I'm not going to use this stupid bag anymore. Worked well with, not winter, but not really going to work well with one of the horizontal or lateral no. horizontal lateral it doesn't really matter um type of texture so i'm going to roll it up while printing how to get it from demonstrating like this uh, it's kind of like zigzags horizontally and i'm going to move my hand in such a way that it will affect that exasper uh, exasper exasperated if you will that took a while, but I got it out. I gotta get that hair out. I got a lot of contaminants here. Ain't the best in your work. And yeah, got my hair. How does this hair keep getting here? This is spring too. Okay, let's get that out. Not mine. I got a beanie on. Oh, not a beanie. On. Cap on. It'd be a bit difficult for them to reach me, or for them to fall off, rather. Sorry about that. Okay. Place this down on my thumb, and then move across, moving towards the right side. For my right, your left. So it looks like that. Beautiful. Okay. And do it again, but higher. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, I just made it a bit worse. No, it's still. Okay. No, I'm just gonna cut this down. See, the colors did interlace, but uh, I don't care. Because, see, you probably didn't even notice. It's pink is even there, too. It's gone. Mm -hmm. It's fine. Um, actually, yeah, I'll I'll put it in. I'll put it for the off white for for the lighter. Okay. Now I'm going to have a, I wanted to do it over here, but a darker version of the palette I am using, dark green. Have it over here, this is what I wanted to do. And then, have it over with black. Like that. Go over again, if you have to. See, it looks like that, pretty fun. Uh, there's a dot right there, which I don't really like, but uh, I'm not, not really able to do anything about it. Try to fix it, it's just gonna make it look worse. And I really do not want to uh, repeat everything I just did, because it will just look worse that many times to learn my lesson. Okay, I'm gonna put the dark green back and these in their rightful positions. Meets in orderly. Get the summer colors out. Almost in summer, summer right now. Didn't really like the heat, but I can deal with it. Go ahead and place that right there. That's for scorching. Even if you know, I'm going for like a sun texture, I go for um, wet colors or wet paint. Because the texture looks more like a sun. But for this, it's not really supposed to be a sun. So I'm just going to let it look like that. I'm not gonna use that. Mm, that's good, yeah, it's fine. Good thing. 
probably going to be the easiest out of them. Don't really have an off-white version, except for a normal off-white that I use for over there. I might use a combination of them. More dark, uh, more black this time. Same texture that I did with spring, but much, much harder. So it comes out like that. There we go. this time because I think I used a very light blue for this or at least part of it. So normal white should do the trick. But more faded like that. Red here. Which I'm gonna use very dark red for this. Similar to what I did over there and with fall. Or in Follow up with black and then overlay with red. That in the middle. Okay, I think it's actually dark. There we go. Okay. Now, I know what's going to happen when I put the stencil on. It's going to stick. It's going to lift up all of what I just did. Except for this. this, the center pieces without the uh, white off whites and the darks, uh, they're they're gonna stay. But these, because they're more wet, they're going to lift off. They're gonna adhere to that stencil and they're gonna rise. Uh, this will be good or bad uh, with my um, interlacing planets, uh, the rainbow one. Um, you can see that that's what happens and. It, it turned out for the better. I don't know if that's going to be the case here. Hopefully it is. Um, that's why I, I put multiple, another is not normal. I put multiple um, layers of dark colors and for whites, and, and that's fine. It, the whites will stay there. Even if the if, um, off whites over here, they, they adhere and they strip off, I could still go over again and with those so i don't really worry i'm not really going to worry about that uh, i suppose i could do the same thing with the darks but uh, i don't know that's actually what i'm, I'm going to do that right now because I want it to be like a slant. Like that. Okay. And these all quite they already achieved that, but the darks did not. Um. Oh no. Oh that's not good. I didn't think that was gonna happen. So yeah, actually, I'm gonna go over one more time with those colors. Yeah, the brown is pretty alright, but I just wanted to check. I want to do navy blue, but I think this will be a bit better. No, it's fine. Um, dark green. This is what I use, but it is the same, same color. What I am going to use. enough red over there but I'm going to spritz it just to be safe. I always want to be safe. 
because I know this isn't much of a risk. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Yeah, that, that's good. That's good. Now, where am I going to put it? Put this over here. Get it all organized. I'm going to do this slowly. I don't want to waste all this time. I might just skip this. Just to wait for them to dry. Um, but these, I really don't want them to peel off. Because if I do let them peel off, most of that hard work that I did doing all that, it's going to be for nothing. Because I really like how it's, it's starting to look. Because I'm going to just over, just a little, just a little bit. Like, this is what it's going to cover. Like this. You see a little bit over, but the sharper areas they're gonna go in, the sharper whites. So it, it would just be the mist that's coming in. So I don't have to worry about that. But the darks, yeah, that those are what I have to worry about. Because I really don't want to do them again. Just to tap off here. Yeah, I'll probably just wait here, fan them a while. Uh, I can use fire, but I really don't want to set off my my sprinklers, the sprinkler system, and that won't be good for anyone, or painting, or me, um, or my family can live here. So, don't want to do that. So I'll just wait here, fan it. My paint scraper, right here. Or something else I could find. Like, waves better. But for now, I'm just stuck here doing this. Washing paint dry. Really, y'all can watch paint dry with me, but for now, I'm just watching a kid watch paint dry, and that's pretty entertaining. If you got nothing else better to do, and I'll just be here talking. If this is fast forward, uh, if this is time lapsed further, then well. You wouldn't really hear me now, would you? You would just hear squeaks, which you would. I don't think that, and that might work. It is fine. I'll just do this. I'm not going to add anything else above it. I know y'all can see like the circles. I'm not going to have like any moons. It would be interesting. More. I, I, yeah, I think it's a good idea, but I don't want to do it. Just having like different transition cloud, uh, moons, sorry, of like, you know, um, border moon, I, I don't know, like, um, the, the wet, the waxing and the, the waning moons, I, I don't, I don't know, I, I think the other one starts with like a G, but I, I don't know the termino terminology of those, so I, I'm just gonna say like quarter halves, like quarter half full, like quarter again, or uh, new moon, like, summer in them, like, mm, new, quarter, half, full, something like that, that would be interesting, or just like these split up, split up, so, like, new moon, um, or, new moon, here, and carry on, or new moon there, doesn't matter, carry on, like, new moon, quarter, half, full, and then, I think the new moon and full moon should be at the side because they do, you know, full moon soon just immediately become new moons. They have to you know, wane or rise, wane, wax, I don't know. So, I know it's, I know when it's done, when I touch uh, the tape, not the actual painting with my latex glove, or just with a uh, piece of paper with weight on it. And uh, if that peels, I keep on doing this. If it doesn't, then, well, I put on the stencil. I'm not putting weight, or well, most of the weight isn't going directly on. Let me see how much weight I'm doing. Ah, considerable amount. Uh, I'm not putting weight, or well, a lot of it, like on the painting, it's gonna be on the tape. Some of it does have to be on the painting um, for it to be completely flat. Because I do, like, what's even worse then having this peeled is having other like black paint seeping in up here. That's worse. 
Is you don't you really don't want that. that ain't good. I mean, you could try to counteract it with having white paint on the outside, but I don't want to change that. I would like the contrast, even just with a little bit. I might add a little bit of white, but that would just be a little bit. Okay, now I'm gonna test nothing. Now I'm going to do um, a small piece of paper. And I'll find it somewhere. It has to be somewhere. Okay, I'm just gonna put it here. I can I can several a considerable amount of weight my finger right there. Okay, and it came up nothing, and that was a very considerable amount of weight. Test nothing for a minute. Test again. A, a little bit, so I'm just gonna keep on doing this. And I will wet it again when I take off the stencil uh, to put my signature over here. But until then, I'm just stuck here doing this. Uh, another thing to talk about I don't know if I should just do like blue skies over like an atmosphere type thing or. If it should just be like space. I, I think I'll just do space. Not just skies. Because, you know, I do space paintings. I don't need to do, you know, normal, normal sky paintings. No, no, in my world, blue skies don't exist. It's all space. Though I do like the blue, blue sky and the clouds. Cloudy days are my favorite. Little piece of shame lore for you. Cloudy days are my favorite type of weather, and favorite type of days in general. But I just like them. I don't see anything depressing about it, like some people. I don't like clear days, too empty. Gotta have sun in the sky. Rather be clouds than galaxies, of course. Kinda ironic how I do this. Not gonna say too much, but got a thing about open spaces. When I think about space, that is the, the most open space, now oh, isn't it? We wouldn't have caught it that if it wasn't open. But somehow, I'm here painting space, so right ironic. I think this is fine. I'm gonna put my finger here again. That's fine. I don't care anymore about this. If it feels, it feels on. I've came to realize that if it does peel, I will be fine. Okay. Nudge this a little bit. No, no. Come on, stop. Wait here, wait here, boom, ow, another word, bolt, 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 and Other bolts for good measure. Did we say? Okay. Yeah, yeah. I think I have a light in there. Have another weight. Um, okay. Have one right here and another here. Okay. I really don't want this to move. Might be one of my best paintings if this goes well. And that's a very big if. Okay. Mm, 
anything and did not intercept or understand why it ain't that good. Yeah. Okay. I scaled or I, I escalated with the darks, but not with the whites. So hopefully nothing bad happens. Mm -hmm. Nothing. And I am recording. Mm. Uh, no, you're not because it's a low battery. Yeah, press it. Oh, okay. And it's fine. Oh, you better hurry, you got like less than 10%. Okay. Like, uh, good. Okay, I've got the darks here. You know, my, my pop told me that it's a very low percent on my phone, it's, it's my camera. So I gotta do this a bit quick, but I don't want to rush it. If I rush it, uh, it's gonna be worse. I'm gonna use a different color. I'm gonna use a turquoise type color or sign. I don't like the other can. Oh, I'm gonna have to use it. It is darker. Uh, actually, no, it's fine. Uh, I like that color. It's good. So, let's take. A bit more. There we go. Okay. Uh, now. I'm going to do some stars. Yes, some stars. Actually, before that, I'm going to do some wine. Stand up for this one. Hopefully, I'm not going to bother when I stand like this. I think this is good. like this. There we go. Alright. That's all good. Let's take all these weights off. Have that brain reveal. 
I really am hoping I'm not gonna do any, I'm not gonna have to do any like decal work and uh, any other work on this. If anything goes wrong, a palette knife, get that ready. And let's get that lift. No, oh, it's sticking. Oh no. Even just by a little bit, it's still not the best. Can't just peel it. Okay, slowly, surely. Okay, okay, slowly. There we go. Okay, okay, here we go. All right. Well, as y'all can see, this did not go well. So I'm gonna have to do this all over again. Well, not all over again. Goodness. Um, but this, um, I, that, 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 the red, uh, the black on the outside, that's fine. I don't care about that. For a second, I, I thought this was, oof, I was scared about that. I thought this was the actual cleaner, but it's just tape. Okay, it's just tape. All right. Um, well. I think this went pretty fine, yeah, pretty good. I'm gonna look at my phone real quick. And I'm gonna come over to y'all, see how my battery's doing. Hope it's not dead. Okay. I'm gonna move this a bit. So if it deserves y'all, okay. It's just at 10%, okay. Okay. I mean, probably didn't help that is going on for way too long. 42 minutes at it, huh? Or 43 maybe? Well, I'm gonna turn that down and post, so y'all don't have to worry about that. Okay. Um, but yeah, 10% battery, that's fun, unless it just plummets. Um, that's not gonna be good, but hopefully it doesn't do that. All right, I'm gonna take these off now. I guess it's dry enough for me to do that. Actually, uh, I'll do the gloss after. Okay. Mm -hmm. What is this? It doesn't matter, it's fine. Get the tape off, come on. Come on, get the tape off. There we go. Okay, now I have to get my gloves off with this. Throw them to the side and let's get peeling. I really hope this doesn't peel off any of the paper. It doesn't look like it will, but you never know. So if y'all can't see the painting, I'll have to drag it to myself for this. Um, Seems pretty crisp. Except for this, but that's fine. I always like the, the tape paintings. They're uh, more of a reveal uh, when you take them off because the difference is so powerful than just having, you know, lid on and off. So much of a difference. That's what I like. Not much of a reveal at the end. It changes everything. Just one piece of tape. It changes so much about what you think about the painting. It's crazy. And it kind of looks like modern art. You know, a big proponent of the ritzy, aristocratic type of modern art where you just put it banana on the wall, but, you know, it's, 
this type of art, it's fine. It's not bad. Other art is take more skill. There's so much more types of, of art forms than this that take mountains more skill than what it takes to do spray art. And there's others that is much less. Um, but maybe I'll do that tangent another day. But yeah, I, this went pretty well. I, I really wanted to do a uh, Four Seasons open. I think this went just fine. Now I'm going to get my gloss out and do my signature. Finalize it. Get this over with. Okay. We do this a little bit. There we go. Okay, that, that should be fine. Ain't the best, but it's good. I'm actually gonna do the gloss some more. I'm not really prioritizing the cave marks. They don't really need gloss, but centerpieces, they do need gloss. Okay, I'm actually gonna put on the light. Sun setting. Hopefully this helps. I'm gonna turn this around so y'all can see. I think it went pretty well. Cool. Well, my pops thinks it went well. So anyway, all the other junk. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe, like, you know, all the other junk, but I don't really care. And if you like what I do, then subscribe. If you don't, then go on to the next thing. If you really like, um, like, um, any other ideas, comments, what have you, um, <clears throat> Instagram, TikTok, I have those, all variations of Shane's spray painting, and they're usually just spray painting Shane, spray paint Shane, what have you. But other than that, I hope you all have a good one. Bye-bye.